The winner is Sir Harrison Birkwistle's Night's Blackbird, The Shadow of the Night and Cry of Anubis with Owen Slade, Tuba, played by the Halley Orchestra under Ryan Wigglesworth for NMC. And here's a few words from Stephen Plaistow. These pieces are wonderful, and the major one in The Shadow of the Night uh, is particularly impressive, I think. Um, think of it, well, there are many ways in which you could think of it, but I think perhaps the most helpful is to imagine it as a kind of nocturne, an examination of a state of mind, a spiritual state of mind, if you like. This would not have been foreign to composers way back in Elizabethan times, where the, the humor of melancholy, as it might be expressed by John Dowland in one of his songs, Harry has mentioned, in Darkness Let Me Dwell. It's an exploration of that, but not as something depressive, um, not at all, but as a kind of examination of that state of mind, which is really a spiritual state of mind, I think, more than anything else. And we're delighted that Sir Harrison Bertwistle himself is here to collect the award. Congratulations. What are you going to take a picture? Um, I'm trying to think what order I can make this, what I have to say. Um, it's like composition. So, um, I have an anecdote. From the age of seven, um, in sort of a little bit in retrospect, um, I was being groomed to be a member of the Halley Orchestra. Um, and it's quite interesting that this, is the, uh, this has been recorded by them. And uh, because my school didn't have any facilities for teaching music, um, I was sent to Manchester every Monday afternoon um, to have lessons with the clarinetist of the Halley Orchestra. And, um, and really, maybe up to the age of 15, somehow I thought that that's where I was going, to the Halley Orchestra. But in the process of, let me come back to another quite interesting thing you might be, uh, 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 the, um, I, I lived in Accrington, so I went from Accrington to Manchester, 20 miles away, and on Monday afternoons. But my father was a farmer, and I had two bags. One, my music and clarinets, and the other bag had cream. <laughs> one day it would be a chicken. And one day I took an entire ham. Why? They were for Barbaroli. <laughs> and and uh, I did this for quite a long time because it was the time of rationing. Um, but fortunately, this dreaded thing called creativity took over. And I lost my interest in playing the clarinet. And um, eventually, um, I got rid of them. So. Um, so the Halley Orchestra, who has done this wonderful recording for me, um, it's, it's this sort of irony in a way that um, this is much better than I imagined because I never did play with the Halley. I played for Bob Rolly, but not with the Halley Orchestra. So, um, so there's that side of it. And um, I suppose I have to thank a lot of people. Um, I got a bit of problem with memory. Um, uh, there's Ryan Wigglesworth who conducted it. There's the Roche Foundation who, uh, who put some money into it. They commissioned uh, Knight's Blackbird. Um, there's Boozy and Hawks, my publishers. Um, who else? Uh, so, still, um, The, the question of classical music, um, I have worries about. I have worries because I'm not quite sure that a lot of people know what it is anymore. I know I'm, as it were, preaching to the converted here, but um, it, it means I'm not quite sure what people mean now by classical music. And 
that classical music is something which is led, as you've gathered from what we've been talking about today, is led by performers. And I get a little bit worried um, about the whole question of time and in where classical music is going as it goes into the mists of time. You know, we go further back, further back. We do the entire works of Bach and Tartus. Um, we do everything over and over again. And, but you have to remember that we composers are the people who invented music. And the, the act of creativity in order to keep classical music alive, you have to have a living culture. You have to have a living heart of music. And um, I'm trying to think of the people I didn't thank, uh, but never mind. <laughs> I, 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 thank you, uh, I thank you all. But, you know, we invented music, and I would remind you what Schoenberg said. He, uh, Schoenberg said, that all art is new art, and all art is conservative. So keep going, and keep the thing together. Okay, thank you. <laughs>